Hey, it's chapter 25 of the My Immortal Quarantine reading, meaning it is also day 25 of My Immortal Quarantine reading. Yes, I've been doing this for 25 days. And I worked out today and I had some coffee, so I'm a little bit buzzy. Plus, I'm super, super, super excited to announce today's very special guest, bringing you chapter 25 is a very good friend of mine please give it up for killjoy with chapter 25. stop flaming okay if you don't i'll tell justin to beat you up and i'll tell all the nerds to put viruses in your computer fuck you raven Thanks for the help. So, I was so excited. I followed Draco, wondering if we were going to do it again. We went outside, and then we went into Draco's black car. Ebony, what the fuck did Professor Trevelry say? Whispered Draco, putting his gothic white hand with black nail polish on mine. She said she would tell me what the visions meant tomorrow, I grumbled in a sexy voice. He took out a heroin cabaret and spiked it and gave it to me to spork. He started to fly the car into a tree. We went to the top of it. Draco put on some MCR. And all the things that you never ever told me and all the smiles that are never, that are ever gonna haunt me, sang Gerard's sexy voice. We started tiling, taking off each other's gloves fervently. He took off my black thong and my black leather bra. I took off his black boxers. Then he put his throbbing, you know, what in my tool sexily oh my fucking god draco draco i screamed having an orgasm we started frenching passively suddenly i fell asleep i started having a dream in it a black guy was shooting two gothic men with long black hair. No, please don't fucking kill us, they pleaded, but he just kept shooting them. He ran away in a red car. No, oh my fucking God, I shouted in a scared voice. Ebony, what's wrong? Draco asked me as I woke up, opening my icy blue eyes. I started to cry and tears of blood went down my face. I told Draco to call Vampire. He did it with his black Lincoln Park mobile. But the worst thing was who the people who were shot in the dream were. Lucian and Sirius. That was beautiful. That was absolutely beautiful. Thank you again, Killjoy, for bringing us chapter 25. I absolutely adored it. You're amazing. And thank you to all of the special guests that I've had and anyone who's agreed to do it in the future. I really appreciate it. It's the difference between this being like a fun thing to do during quarantine and me just like me reading my mortal into the void. So if you would like a chapter of my mortal quarantine reading, please let me know. I really love getting requests for chapters and if I don't get some for a while, then I might meekly show up in your DMs to be like, hey, could you do me a favor? So to avoid that, please volunteer for a chapter. Help me stay sane. <laughs> also, again, I know I keep saying it, but uh, if you haven't checked out the web series, My Mortal Web Series by Media Junkie, it's amazing. You should check that out. And yeah, I guess take care of yourselves, do whatever you need to do. And if you have anything in you, make a little bad art, maybe.
be the Terry Gillespie you want to see in the world. <laughs>